get through mission four, and now it is time to continue our quest. It's on to mission five, baby. Mission freaking five. This, I believe, is nearing the, uh, the end of the game, so let's get back to it. Let's get back, man. Mission five time. Mission five hype. We're clicking on through to the next chapter. Legend. Your first live stream Battlefield Horrors. Welcome, buddy. Interesting. Why do I feel like they've already died? I need a vacation. It's great to have you all back. Why? Yeah. What? <laughs> okay. I guess, um... I guess they just come back. Hello, Music Martin. Welcome. There's no time to rest, but the situation is critical. Xenoliver? Yes. What the hell are those assholes after now? Where's Jack? Is this Jack? Dude, what in the hell is happening? Genocide. What? Liam, it can't be possible. Stop worshipping that terrorist, Sergeant. They made it clear in their demands. The Constellar Federation must abolish alien slavery or... They will unleash the Medusa virus across the entirety of Gactus 7. They never died, Barry. You saved them. This is all an illusion. Yeah, apparently Jack has an afro. I had no idea. But Gactus 7 is one of the planets with the highest rate of slaves over humans. What do they want to do? Free them by killing them? Not at all. They were after the Medusa virus from the beginning since it only affects animals. Or mammals, rather. God, this font is so confusing sometimes. Their objective is to create a free world for aliens, making a planet uninhabitable for human beings. Okay, this should be easy then. Destroy Xenolifer's mothership, problem solved. Uh, Music Martin is going to be for a very long time, this new schedule. Uh, the 5 to 10, Monday to Saturday. Those demands were made a week ago. The Stellar Federation refuses to negotiate with terrorists. And the Medusa virus became airborne 37 hours ago. There's no need to panic here. I know the cure. We can produce an antidote now. I'm afraid it's not that easy. Of course it's not that easy! Xenolifer developed a genetically encrypted mutation of the virus, Xenomedusa, and only they have the antidote. How many people are at risk? Ellipsis. Four billion. Damn it! Damn it, Liam! Damn it! Liam! They're still open to negotiate. If the Constellar Federation accepts their demands, the Xenolifer will launch the antidote into Gactus 7's atmosphere. No, they won't accept. The Constellar Federation never negotiates. For them, Gactus 7 is just another piece on their board. But anything they'll even use the tragedy is propaganda. So that's it, I guess. We aren't superhuman bur burden. There's nothing else we can do. Well, apparently you're pretty superhuman, Donald, because you were dead last time I checked. I shot you in the goddamn face. We should get some rest to focus on how to stop Xenolifer in the future. How's it going, Gage? No, I'll go. I'm gonna stop them. You are insane. Well, let me go with you, Burden. It's kind of a miracle we all ended up here in the hallway pretty quickly. No, not this time. This is a one-man mission. This is suicide! You should have gotten used to suicide missions by now, Jack. I'm finishing the calculations now. You should collide with Xenolifer's mothership in 2 hours and 29 minutes. I don't have exact data on the integrity of the Matriarch's hull, but... You have approximately a 32% chance of surviving the crash. Burden, are you sure you still want to proceed? Donald's too busy playing Angry Birds to care. <laughs> That's a gift from the gods in the face of saving 4 billion lives. Let me get this straight. You're gonna fire yourself out into space, piloting a one-man cruiser heading toward the Matriarch. Aiming directly at the core labs of the ship, retrieve the antidote, and then manually fire it into Gactus 7's atmosphere. Exactly! You're saying this isn't a suicide mission? Yes. What about being inside a collapsing spaceship surrounded by enemy forces? I'll figure it out. <laughs> okay. I ate your flesh, Donald! I know! What's happening? Thank you for everything, Burden. We owe you our lives. <sighs> Alright. Through all the pain, suffering, and success, it's been an honor, Sergeant. Woof! <laughs> Say goodbye to everybody. You're going with the Sergeant. My AI module will allow me to commandeer the droid rocket, allow me or allowing me to disperse the antidote's reactive agents over the planet's atmosphere. This means I won't come back 100% sure. I'm so glad I can be of service until the end. Goodbye, everybody. 
Gonna play the game over screen a minute. Interesting. Marvin is critical to the plot, it's true. Apparently I'm a robot too. Okay, you're ready to go. While Brandon is connected to your spacesuit, he can provide useful intel during the mission. At this point, you should at least feel sorry for doubting him all those months ago before Cynicos. Gods, Donald, you are, you are a rancorous nerd! Don't mind me, I'm just Google searching rancorous real quick. Characterized by bitterness or oh! resentment. <laughs> Rhapsody! <laughs> Woof! Rhapsody, <laughs> thank you very much for the tip. Spending bot! Appreciate you. Just try to come back alive to honor Brandon's heroic sacrifice. Sure. Sergeant, go and kick some Xeno life or ass. High five! Goodbye, team. We'll meet again in this life or the next. Beautiful. Nerd! <laughs> Alright. Brandon, are you seeing this? Outer space. An endless sea of scattered dust. And a vast veil of darkness. I don't know why, but this cold void feels like home. It's hard not to feel completely insignificant in the face of all this darkness. Have you ever considered your purpose, Brandon? What it means to exist in this vast darkness? Out here, it makes you wonder what four billion lives really mean. Just another white dot. One of a million pinpricks of light. Each one indifferent to its inhabitants. Millions of points of light. So far in the future that they have already died. Why did I spend my whole life protecting them? What am I protecting exactly? I spent my whole life fighting and I don't even know why. In fact, I can't remember anything beyond fighting. I never had a home. Sad boys. We aren't so different, you and I, Brandon. You and I are the same. I too have never known childhood. It's like they've only existed to save the world again and again. Not for duty, respect for life, or any human values. Unlike Marvin, just can't stop chasing after that damn stick. His cause is the only thing that's ever felt true. As long as the gods keep tossing that stick, I'll keep bringing it back. This meaningless world. Damn. Whoa. Alright. We're in the desert now. It's good. Travel. Which direction should we travel in? Oh! North, south, east, or nest? West. <laughs> Jemmy, how's it going? How you doing? Hope you're feeling better. Like if you cry ever, Tim. Sergeant Burden is Marvin confirmed. Let's go south. Alright. Hmm. Well, it looks like this might be something I need a notepad for. Looks like we can't go any further south. Let's go east. It's weast, Patrick! Oh shit, well that's a wall. Hmm. We can go further south though. Sure. Oh shit. We must go nest. Guys, definitely, okay, definitely don't tell me the exact directions to go on the first time I play Mission 5. Please, please don't do that. Okay, east we go. Interesting. Oh, hold on. Cactus. Get water. Oh, good. I'm not thirsty. Well, save it for later, you dickhead. Why wouldn't you just get some for now? Oh my god. Alright, well, we're gonna keep going east, I guess. You survived. Indeed you did. Your jaw is practically broken. Oh, damn. Oh! Freeze! Identify yourself. Where am I? What is this place? Are you wearing an Everdusk spacesuit? Yeah, the nebula. I had an accident? 
I don't know, sir. You're on the desert planet of Legion in the middle of a war. We fight for the Constellar Federation, of course. I see. How can I help? Sir, you just survived what should have been a fatal orbital shipwreck, and you're telling me you're ready for action? I heard Everdusk is full of puny nerds. By the gods, was I wrong? Is there a point to all this, soldier? Your insignia denotes sergeant, sir, so technically you're in command. And frankly, if your spacesuit's transceiver still works, you could save us all. Save you how? How many of you are there? This is embarrassing, but our platoon got lost in the desert, and the rendezvous deadline is 152 hours. Okay, let's join your platoon and hurry our way back. Sir, what is your name? Just call me sergeant for now. I can't remember. Okay. Ooh, who's this? So I found him while I was exploring the area. Ooh, it's Abraham again. He's a sergeant with Everdusk. Miraculously, he survived an air-to-surface orbital space wreck. Space wreck. <laughs> a whole bunch of nerds, yeah. Take it easy, vac vac. Thank you for the tip today, buddy. He offered his help in the fact that he could make use of space suits transceiver. It's still functional, sir. Is that true, Sergeant? Just point me in a direction. I'll do my best to lead you there. It might be a sign of the gods. I thought we were damned to this place already. I'm Sergeant Abraham. It'll be a pleasure to follow your lead, Sergeant. Just Sergeant. He, he called you Sergeant. You dumbass. Very well to wear then. We know our base camp is northwest from here, but this desert is treacherous. This move will rest when the sun is down. The only time the deserts of Legion know darkness are when the sandstorms block out the sun. He's saying the Legion has no night. The two suns keep this planet as deserted as it can get. Corporal Maslow was born here. The nomadic children of Legion are tough as hell, so you'd be wise to listen to his advice. Our best option is to use as little water as possible. We should only drink when our bodies are crying for it. Sleeping under the sun is suicide. If we want to rest, we'll have to look for shelters behind cool shadows. Very interesting. And the fact, there's also the fact that we're currently engaged in a full-fledged retreat from a war that we cannot win. We should watch out for rebel patrols and enemy camps. It's where our scouts can explore the terrain ahead for us, but time is of the essence. Always keep that in mind. Those bastards took it away from me. The desert sand is making it look ugly. If you feel you need to make any sacrifices, I give you full authority to do so, starting with me. I don't even know this guy. Shut up and respect your commanding officer, Private. Maybe mar marooned in the desert, but you're still going to follow the chain of command. You can count on me, Sergeant. Both of you can. This desert won't forgive any missteps, and friendships won't save anyone out here. So man up and let's move. Okay. So. Learning. Looks like the, uh... The variables here are we meet, need to move northwest. We need to preserve water. All these dudes have names. Oh, God. Oh, no. Oh, no. There's a lot more variables than I initially thought. Oh, God. Well, let's get some water, I guess. Right? Can we collect it now? Good. I was hoping so. Beautiful. Okay, so we have water. Now we have six extra rations of water. Excellent. So I'm imagining we'll have some kind of tell from, uh, from the party members here of when they're thirsty. Let's see. Quest information. Uh, let's check on thirst. This is the crew's thirst. Perfect. Okay, cool. So Dr. Todd, obviously somebody we should keep alive. Everybody's stamina is perfect. Excellent. Uh, let's see. Ask about... Stim shots. If a stamina soldier drops to zero, he'll collapse. These shots will restore their stamina and get them back on their feet, but without water it won't matter and he'll faint again soon. Cool. Okay, it's serious Sam. Indeed. <laughs> Indeed it is. That's awesome. Alright. Okay. Yeah, who needs real science in a game, Cosmic Luck, honestly? Alright, so... Let's just start off by killing Abraham. <laughs> uh, well, I guess what we want to do... Mission status. 150 hours to the deadline. They said their camp was northwest from where we met. We have 20 rations of water, 3 clips of ammo, 2 explosives, and 2 stim shots. Hmm. Check signal. Transceiver isn't getting anything, we're too far away. Alright, so I uh, guess let's travel. 
And let's go west. Since that's the way we need to go. Alright, two hours have gone by now. Let's check the status of everybody. Uh, let's check our thirst. Everyone's still perfect. Cool. Alright, that's easy enough. Stamina levels. Probably want to look for somewhere to rest at some point. Let's travel north. There we go. Alright, we can go west again here. You should get rid of me to give the rest a chance. No, shut up, Abraham. We're fine. All right. This is what happens if you backwards in the first mission of SS, the first encounter. <laughs> I kind of get it. Right, let's have a quick look at the stamina levels. Might as well. Uh, everybody's still perfect. Cool. Thirst. Uh, everybody's good. Okay. We have a good amount of water. Let's see if we can maybe, uh... Hmm. You can use your scouts to see what's ahead before you travel. Yeah, I kind of figured that was the case, but... I think we're probably... Actually, yeah, maybe we should... Since we have two options now, let's go ahead and look. So let's see. Uh, not Jack. Let's actually ask Jack about something. Uh, let's ask Jack about traveling. Traversing this dead land is harsh, and it never gets easier, trust me. Being a large number doesn't make us stronger either. The slow soldier in the group will set the speed we travel at. You should seriously consider restoring our thirst and stamina before traveling, if possible. If we don't have enough resources, maybe the best solution is to leave someone behind. Not a nice option, I agree, but we both know that this is about staying alive. And survival usually implies sacrifices. That's so true, Jack. I'm so glad you agree with me, because that's the only way I beat Mission 4. So maybe I should just leave Abraham behind early on. Doesn't really seem to be a morale aspect of this. So it looks like these guys are the scouts, right? Or is it... Okay, here's, an, here's a scout. I need you to explore the area west. Uh, let's go... Two zones. Two zones west. Ooh, he's not doing great. Nothing but desert. Nothing but desert. Alright, so we don't want to go west. That's what we figured out. Let's give this guy some water. Since he did such good work for us. There you go. There you go, buddy. You're better. You're better. You're fine. Alright, everybody else is doing uh, not the greatest in the world, though. Let's check thirst levels. Nil is perfect. Everyone else is good. So I'm going to head north in the hopes that there's going to be... Oh, everybody's stamina is perfect, actually, so that's not really that big of a deal. Let's head north, considering that's obviously the, uh... The, uh... Better option to hopefully find something good. And there's nothing. Hmm. Right, everybody's getting kind of tired. Let's see. Man, I can... I like how it, uh... How it very accurately reflects the idea of being out in the middle of the desert suffering because this looks pretty awful okay everyone's doing all right let's see stamina wise still perfect hmm slowly whittles you down to nothing yeah exactly okay um hmm let's check the signal I guess Yep, nothing. That's not what I... Or, yeah, kind of what I expected. Okay, so let's send another scout off. I think this guy can go. Or no. Uh, this one? Yeah, okay. I think the scouts are the ones with the... Uh, little scars around their necks. Let's have this guy check out the area west. And go for... Oh, man. Setting the pace. Let's just go one zone. Okay. Nothing but desert. Hmm. Looks like I want to take a gamble on going north again. I did notice that burning night. Yeah, you can give water to everyone. I'll probably do that after we go north here if we don't find anything. Oh boy. Alright, let's give everybody some water. If everyone who is thirsty drinks will spend eight rations of water, let them drink. Let them drink! Alright. There we go. Uh, so I'm gonna go ahead and take a gamble here and travel west. 
So we're still going in the right direction. Oh my god. Hmm. Alright, everyone's still doing okay. We really need to find some water soon. Yeah, everybody's fine. Stamina-wise, Nil and Romero both need to rest. Let's check the mission status here for our uh, consumables. We have plenty of water still if we need to drink again. Alright, well, tell you what, I'm going to send somebody west. It's not going to be that guy. Let's go with Star Leech here. You are going to explore west for me, buddy. And let's go two zones. No, it's not boring. It's actually pretty interesting. I like the uh, I like the variables in this one. Nothing but desert. My route was blocked by a huge wall, so I had to come back. Okay, so there's a wall blocking our path in the west, and there's nothing valuable. So again, while we didn't find anything good, it means we have a slightly improved chance of finding something beneficial to the north. Hello, speaking of which. What do we have here? Remains of battle. Scavenge. We could find something useful if we search around. Hopefully we find some water. I seriously doubt it, but we'll probably find some uh, weaponry and stuff. Find cl five clips of ammo. Alright, well, that's slightly helpful, I guess. Uh, let's see. So, let's check status of all of our folks again. I think we're getting kind of thirsty at the moment. Stamina's probably dwindling a little bit as well. Everybody's good. Stamina. Yeah, we definitely need to find somewhere to rest. Uh, let's go ahead and take a gamble on going west here. We've been, going, we've been going north quite a bit. Oh, shit. Did we lose? Oh, god damn it. Okay. <laughs> that kind of sucks. Alright, looks like we probably want to scout more often then. Alright, blah 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 yeah, I figured things changed every time, Skybreather, so I'm uh, expecting things to uh, be different. Alright, so that's good, so let's travel west. And we'll probably travel west again just because we know it's safe. Just do like an L and lock the fuck out, <laughs> yeah. Alright, we're going to travel west again. Oh, the direction of the... Oh, whoops. Oh, I thought you meant, like, the direction of the enemy camps can change. Oh, that's stupid. Alright, which direction is the camp, then? Northeast. God damn it. That's stupid. I'm just gonna reset, then. I didn't realize that could happen. Okay, so where does he say... ...the camp is? Uh, which direction? Blah, blah, blah. Actually, I can just skip through all this and then just check the mission status and I'll know where the camp is going. So there we go. I'm glad it shows me after the fact. Okay. Northeast this time. Alright, so let's go ahead and explore east now. There we go. Let's do, uh, three zones. Just to be safe. Three hours later. Oh! <laughs> From Jimmy! <laughs> Oh, thank you very much, Jemmy. I hope you're doing well today. Appreciate that a lot, Jemmy. Big old bear hug. Thank you very much for the tip. Appreciate that. Nothing but desert. Nothing but desert. And a cactus. Ooh, good. Okay. We're going to go east three times for sure. That is excellent. Very, very good. Good scouting, my friend. We're going to travel east three times. Really glad we did three zones. That was very convenient. We should probably try to do that uh, as often as possible. Okay, there's a cactus, and we'll obviously have to go north here. Oh, shut up, Abraham. You're fine. All right, we will get water. I wonder if the uh, amount of water we currently have affects the uh, amount of water we can get. Let's uh, do this on the off chance that that does. All right, everybody drink up, and then we'll get some water. Beautiful. 
The music is pretty awesome for this mission. Yeah, I totally agree. It's really cool. We got ourselves four. Ooh, that's not as many as I would hope for, but all right. All right, explore again. Actually, let's check to see if anybody else has a bit more stamina. Let's go with this. Stamina-wise, yeah, so Nil's a little bit off, so let's send Star Leech instead. You're gonna go explore North 3 zones. Let's see how that goes. There we go. Across the terrain which seemed moist. Nothing but desert and more moist terrain. Alright, let's see what that first moist terrain is, and then we'll uh, see if we can maybe take advantage of that twice coming up here. What could this be? Moist terrain. Dig for water. Yes, absolutely spend three hours digging for water. That's a great idea. Yeah, four zones might be more beneficial. I agree. Ten rations of water. Sweet! Okay, let's go north twice now. Definitely want to do that. And apparently we can hold an uh, in indefinite amount, so... No problem going this route. Let's go north again. There we go. More moisture. Fantastic. Please, please, be beneficial. Don't misclick. Here we go. Totally worth the time. Put us in a great position for later on, hopefully. Eight rations, okay. By, uh, I think we are safe to go ahead and explore to the east here. Oh, just kidding, we have to go north. Alright, let's have you go for... Two hours, because I'm pretty sure I'm going to have to give some people some water after that. Water. Nothing but desert. Some kind of a shelter. Ooh, perfect! Okay, two hours. So let's give everybody water first. And then two, two little traveling sessions later we'll be able to rest. That'll be good. There we go. Alright. Excellent. North. North we go. Support the marshmallow! I know, burden with that little flask of water with enough water for everybody. That's beautiful. Better drink my own piss, yep. A little bit hot outside. Get beautiful, let's rest. How's our stamina, actually? I wonder if we really need to. We might as well, now that we have an opportunity. Shelter. Sleep. Okay, let's sleep for three hours since we don't really need that much. There we go! Hope you all slept well. This desert can be fatal for a tired body. Like you know, Sergeant. Come on. Alright, stamina should be perfect now, so let's check on thirst. Everybody's good. Alright, excellent. So, let's scout to both the north and the east now. I'm gonna send you east four zones right now. Because I really hope that'll... Oh, he's just doing three. Okay. This is what I saw. Found a cactus we can get water from. Beautiful. Sneaked across an enemy patrol, two zones to the east. Okay, so we want to go one zone to the east and then go north. Good. Let's give him some water. Very, very good. There's a lot of piss you can drink. Yeah, we got plenty of piss. From these folks. Alright, so we're going east once. We're going to get some water from the cactus. And then we're going to head north. Actually, we should probably check north just to be sure we're not going to run into another enemy patrol. So we'll go explore north after we do this. Beautiful. Good old cactus plant. Fantastic. Give me like 12. 5. Alright, that's fine. Uh, you can send the true. Oh, right! That's true! We could go kill the enemy patrol and then we'll probably get some uh, benefit from that, right? Yeah, let's try that out. That sounds like fun. Alright, troopers lead the attack. Grey shock. Lead the attack east. Let's see how that goes. Current chance of victory is 50%. Uh, let's send Jack with you. Actually, if we send just one guy. Let's do this. Yeah, send Rasmus. 100% chance of victory. Yep, there we go. Send the attack. We got it. Sweet. Crush them, that was a flawless attack. Good job, team. Alright, Grey Shock and uh, what's his bucket needs some water, obviously. Actually, everybody's doing kinda a little worse for wear right now. Actually, is this uh hmm, hang on a second. 
Two clips of ammo and they were carrying two rations of water. Beautiful. Alright, what's our status, Doctor? How's the stamina going? That's what I'm more curious about. Everyone's perfect stamina-wise. Let's give, uh... If everyone's down to, like, okay, I think I want to give them some water right now. Yeah. Let's let everybody drink. Give water to everybody. Seven rations, that's totally fine. And I'm pretty sure we still have a decent amount. Yeah, we have 16 left, so that's good. Alright, so we can't go east, so we're gonna have to take a gamble on going north once. No, honestly, I shouldn't do that. Let's just explore just to make sure. So let's go north three zones. There we are. Yeah, I'm getting pretty lucky, I think, right now, dear. Things are going pretty well. Oh my god, more moist terrain, and there's a huge wall at n north zone two. So obviously we're gonna go north once. And I should probably check on how many hours I have left to get to where I need to go. I should probably check on my, uh... Ooh, I'm gonna have to go west, though. Alright, well... Let's check on mission status and then check on my transceiver. See how we're doing. Eight rations of water, that's awesome. Alright, let's check the signal. Nothing. Oh, we're getting closer. Oh, nice. Excellent. Okay, we have uh, 110 hours, so that's plenty of time. We got 24 rations of water, so let's go ahead and head west. We should explore west, actually. Just to be 100% safe. So let's go west for two zones, because obviously we don't want to go too far. If we just find desert, we're likely to... Uh, in fact, I probably should have only explored one zone. A lot of remains from battle for ammunition, and then nothing but desert. All right, so we're probably going to hope for uh, the ability to move north once we go west here. So this is good. We'll find some more ammunition. We don't really have to, but we might as well. So we've still got quite a bit of time, I think. We can't go north right now as well, so we'll probably have to explore that. Who is in the best condition to explore right now? Uh, everybody's pretty good. Rasmus, Dr. Todd, Sir Sam, Grayshock. Pretty much everybody but the explorers, unfortunately. Let's see. I need you to explore north. Just go for... Hmm. Let's just go one zone, because I think I want to go east still. We'll check this out. Nothing but desert. Alright, safe to go. Let's all go north. And we really want to find some more shelter, I think. Oh, damn. We both know the slowest soldier sets the travel speed for the whole group. If you don't give me water and rest, we're all going to die. Oh, no. Hang on a second. Let's check out the thirst levels here. Oh, boy. Everybody needs to drink. Alright. That is totally doable. Let's check how many water rations we have right now. I'm pretty sure we're going to be okay. Yes, definitely let them drink. Alright. Everybody looks to be a lot better at the moment. Check the thirst. Everybody's perfect. Good. Wonderful. Now, stamina-wise, try taco. How's it going? Uh, Nil is still struggling. I might have to leave Nil behind. Alright, tell you what. Let's explore with one of these guys that's doing really well. Let's go let's see if Starleech or Romero is able to explore right now. Check on their stamina levels. Starleech is good. Romero is good. Unfortunately, uh, none of them are perfect. I wish I could explore myself. That would be nice. Can Jack explore? No, I can't explore. Okay, well. Let's send Romero, I guess. Romero just gonna explore two zones to the north. Let's see what he gets. Check signal kind of gives you an idea of how close you are with the, with the uh, transceiver. Enemy patrol two zones to the north. They might have some more water. But I'm pretty sure... I'm pretty sure uh, the more important thing right now is to get rest. So let's see if... Uh, let's check the signal real fast, actually. Signal hasn't changed. We're as far away as the last time we checked. Okay, so we're gonna go north once, for sure. And we'll see if the wall's still there when we go north. Okay, it's not there anymore. So we could, uh, take a gamble. I think I'm safe to do that, actually. I'm pretty sure we can get away with sending a couple of our troops over to, uh, lead the attack on the north. So let's do that. 
And uh, 50% plus Gray Shock, we can do this again, and that gets us up to 100% chance of victory. We could also use Explosives. I'm not entirely opposed to that idea, but nah, I think we're going to be okay with just using Gray Shock, and then we'll be good to go. Send it off! There we go. Should have gone well. Flawless attack, beautiful. Alright, let's see what they got here. Hopefully some, uh, water. A ration of water. No, uh, well, that's not that great. Let's do a quick check on status. Thirst levels were all good, so that's good. Stamina is obviously the big problem right now. Let's have a quick look here. Alright, well... That's all of our explorers who are only doing okay. You can rest in an enemy base. Oh, that's good to know. Alright, so... Fortunately, we're gonna have to send one of these guys out. Let's go to the east. Send them out for one zone, just to make sure we can, uh... Actually make it somewhere. And we're probably gonna have to give him some water when he gets back. Nothing but desert. <sighs> well... Shit. Hmm. How's he doing now? Thirst wise. I'll probably give everybody some water as soon as we go east again. Actually, you know what? I'll tell you what, let's do this. You explore to the north. See if we can get lucky there. Oh, you can go for two zones. Let's do let's do th two. So I'm pretty sure I'm gonna have to give people some water when you get back. Oh god. You should have returned by now. I think I have to abandon him. Wait an hour. I'm gonna abandon him and I'm gonna go east. Better hurry and find shelter. Yeah, this is not going well. Oh boy. Alright, well. Let's give water to everybody real quick. Alright, I forgot we have the stim shot. Yeah. Alright, so we know it's safe to go east at least. So let's do that. We really need to find some shelter here. Hmm. It's the Darude Sandstorm. Uh, let's do a quick check on stamina here. Yeah, that would be nice if you could send multiple explorers at once. I wish that was the case. Well, we may have to take a gamble because we really need to find shelter. So let's send Nil on a two hour exploration to the east. Actually, I think we can only afford to do two hours total. Alright. Oh, perfect! Shelter! Oh, thank god. Alright, let's go east. That is super convenient. Very, very good. We are all going to... Actually, let's see how much time we can afford to give with this. 84 hours. Yeah, we got plenty of time. It's just a matter of the amount of water rations I have. Actually, let's check on our status, see how much we really need to rest here. Stamina-wise, a lot of us are doing good, but Nil is doing bad. Let's rest for five hours. I think we'll be okay. I think we'll be okay. Whoa! What the hell? Oh, what did he say? God damn it. I keep skipping things on accident. Why? Pull yourselves together. Sergeant Abraham's decision has given us a chance. Why did he die? He's a true leader. You joined the Constellar Federation to give your lives to the mission. Did he kill himself? He just did so for his mission to do whatever is necessary to see us all get back to base. Don't let his sacrifice go to waste. We must survive this. Okay, so apparently Sergeant Abraham killed himself to give us a better chance. Wow. That's insane. Well, I mean, we're all doing really well now. That's good. Thirst levels are okay. Let's go on an exploration mission. Let's, uh, send you north. We're gonna go for three zones here. We have this shelter, which is convenient. Oh, come on. Well, I think we're safe to wait an hour. Man. 
Come on back, buddy. There he is. Good boy. Enemy patrol to the north. Enemy camp. Two zones to the north. Huge wall. After the enemy camp. Okay. We don't necessarily need to rest, but let's see what we can do. Let's lead the attack to the north, obviously. If I take Rasmus as well, 100% chance, so let's do that. There we go. Flawless attack. We need to give some folks some water here. How much do we have right now? We need to find some. I bet the enemy camp has a lot of water, actually. They had a ration there as well. Let's go ahead and let everybody drink. Get everybody back on their feet. Okay, let's go for the uh, let's go for the enemy camp. I bet we can do this. Let's lead an attack to the north. Twenty five percent chance of victory right now. So you take Jack and you use explosives. We don't have any more ammo for reinforcements, which means we definitely want to do this, and then hopefully we get a lot of stuff from the enemy camp. So there we go. Crushed them. That was a flawless attack. Good job, team. Alright, let's see what we can get from this. Scavenge. Yes, definitely want to do that. What do we find here? Four clips of ammo and nine rations of water. That is fantastic. That's a very good result. All right, let's check on our stamina, because if we, if we need to take a quick rest here, we can totally do that. And then I'm pretty sure what we want to do is head south and then go east again. 105% chance of victory. Yeah, exactly. I'll take those odds. Let's check on our mission status here. We've probably got plenty of time. 14 rations of water. Let's check the signal real fast. 5% chance of victory and I fail. I wouldn't be surprised. We are getting closer. So I'm going to go south and then go east. Because I definitely don't want to have to go west again. So we've been going north quite a bit. I don't know. Maybe I should go west. I don't think I need to rest here. Let's check on the status of thirst. Real fast. Everyone's perfect. Alright, that's good. Get plenty of rations. Let's go south. So we know that's safe. Maybe I should rest here real fast. You know what? I am going to rest here real fast. Just to be extremely cautious. Ah, uh, no, nah, never mind. I think we'll be... Ah, but I, yeah, I'm going to do it. Just to be very, very safe with our choices here. Okay. Hope you all slept well. Good. All right, now we're going south. And then we're gonna we're gonna scout to the east, probably for three zones. It's only taking us an hour to move through sections now, so that's good. Now this guy is good to go. We're gonna scout to the east for three zones. See how we're doing there. IRL, your cousin had a one percent chance of living. Oh my goodness! Oh god! Come on now. Looks like there's probably another enemy camp somewhere. Please come back. Thank you. Enemy camp, one zone to the east. Enemy patrol, two zones to the east, and a ca Very good, okay. Let's give you some water. And then we should, now that we've got the clips from the last fights, we should be able to easily take out these uh, enemy camps. Alright. Should be good to go. Let's have Greyshock lead the attack to the east. 25% chance we are going to take Jack. And, uh, let's... I don't know if we should use some explosives. We'll take Serious Sam. And we'll take, uh... Dr. Todd. <laughs> no. We might as well go for that 105% chance if we can, so... Let's do it. There we go. Camp cleared out. We're definitely gonna scavenge this, because that's the entire point of doing that. Three hours, totally worth it. Probably have to give everybody some water after that. Remember, never eat soggy waffles. I remember that. Five clips of ammo and seven rations of water. That's fantastic. Let's check on our thirst levels right now. Let's see. Everybody's okay. All right, we're probably good to move, but we have to lead another attack, obviously. you got to remember that. So let's go lead attack to the east with Grayshock. 
and get uh, Rasmus with you, and you got the 100% chance of success again. Very good. Then we got the uh, cactus in the next one as well. Gotta remember that too. I should probably check my. Uh, I should probably check my transceiver after this. That replaces the two clips that we had. Let's give everybody water. Get people going again. And we'll get more water as soon as we get back over to the east. So let's check the transceiver as soon as we gather water from this cactus. And then uh, we'll see how we're going. Alright. Super deadly cactus, yes. How much did we get? Five extra rations, beautiful. Alright, let's check this real fast. Squirrel use water cannon, yeah. We're getting closer, nice. Alright, so, let's scout to the north. Explore to the north. Let's go for two hours. So I think we're getting pretty close right now. I think we're getting pretty damn close right now. Nothing but desert, nothing but desert. Okay, so, don't want to go that way. Let's check out the east. See if we can find some valuable stuff. Let's go for two hours this way. Please just come back. Oh my god. It looks like there's another enemy camp in that direction. Alright, thank you for coming back, buddy. Enemy camp and a huge wall after the enemy camp. So we could go to the enemy camp again and probably rest. That seems like a pretty decent idea. Let's do that. So let's go to the east. Lead attack by Jack, Sam, and uh, Rasmus. And uh, let's see here. We got 80% chance. And I would rather have 130%. <laughs> Since we can. No reason to give that 20% chance a shot at ruining my day. Alright, we gotta give everybody water right now. We're gonna get some water hopefully from the scavenge after we do this. Only two people needed it actually, so there we go. Let's check how many hours we have left. 55, we got plenty of time. Let's scavenge this real fast. And then we'll probably rest here because I'm pretty sure my stamina is not that great right now. Let's see what we get. Four clips of ammo and eight rations of water. Fantastic. So let's check the status from Dr. Todd. Dork Souls, how's it going, buddy? Okay. Yep, everybody needs a quick break. So let's sleep here for a good three hours. Let's see how we're going after that. All right, there we go. Have a quick look at this again. Stamina-wise, we should be fine. Yep, everybody's perfect except Gray Shock, so that means we can probably keep him behind if we need to lead another attack. Checking our thirst. Everyone's doing okay. Actually, who's the two perfect people? Let's see if I got another uh, scout that doesn't need to have water. Nil and Romero. Both of my scouts, I believe. Yeah, sweet. That's good. All right, let's go north for three hours. See what you can find. There we go. A lot of remains from battle, that's good. Uh, nothing but desert and some kind of shelter. I don't think we necessarily need the shelter, so maybe we'll go north once and then see what we can do after that. So we'll go north and scavenge the remains and probably find some more clips. Let's check our transceiver again real fast just in case we're going uh, further away from the campsite. Getting closer. Okay, good. Scavenge for three hours. Is it really worth it? Probably. I'm pretty sure time is not going to be that big of an issue. Let's see what we can find. Five clips of ammo. Sweet. Okay. How are we doing uh, water-wise? Check our thirst levels. Everyone kind of needs to drink. I think we can go east one time. We've got, yeah, we got plenty of water, actually, so we might as well just have people drink now. Let's do that. There we go. Okay, and uh, let's scout to the east with Nil. Because we know that uh, there's a shelter two zones further to the north, so if we don't find anything over here, maybe we'll want to go to the north just to be careful. Alright, looks like there's another enemy camp this way. Please come back, Nil. We've been getting lucky with this. There we go. Very good. Nothing but desert. Enemy patrol, and then the enemy camp at the third zone. Okay, so... We're gonna go east once and then east again. Then we'll check our transceiver after we do that. Or we're gonna take the enemy patrol out with the attack. 
Oh, he needs some water. I can give him some water. That's fine. That's fine, buddy. There we go. Everything in this game just takes so goddamn long, I know. And we're all just waiting around for hours, waiting for one person to go do something. Alright, Grey Shock, lead the attack to the east. And let's take Rasmus with you. The dynamic duo of Rasmus and Grey Shock always taking things out. Just got here, Orange Halo. Welcome, buddy. Alright, search it up. Ration of water and a clip of ammo. That's not bad. Uh, you can drink, buddy. That's fine. I'll happily give you a drink if you just make your freaking way over to your position. God! <laughs> Hurry it up. There we go. Give Romero some water. Hmm. So there was the enemy camp to the east, if I recall correctly. Yeah, that's what it was, for sure. So let's lead the attack to the east. Uh, let's have a quick check. I think we might need to rest again. Let's have a look at stamina. Grayshock's doing okay. Everybody else is perfect, actually. Let's have a look at thirst again. Huh. Mission status. 35 hours. We've got two stim shots. Plenty of water. Check the signal again. Let's see where we need to go. I'm getting closer still. Maybe I should scout to the north, just in case. Let's do that. Let's explore two zones to the north. Hopefully that'll uh, shed some light on the situation a little further. Oh, he's still gone. God damn it. Keep running into enemy camps, man. This is crazy. Alright, he came back. Enemy camp to the north. Nothing but desert. Let's lead an attack on the enemy camp to the north. See what we can do. Take Jack with ya. Take Sam with ya. And take, uh... Grayshock, yeah. Actually, let's take Romero, because I'm pretty sure Grayshock is really tired. I like 92. 92 is enough for me. Hopefully it works out. There we go. Flawless attack. Alright, we all need a good rest. I think I can probably... Actually, I might as well... No, I think I can scavenge before I... Rest. I think we're safe to do that. 32 hours to the deadline. Let's check the signal. See how close we're getting. Getting closer, alright. We're gonna scavenge and then we're gonna sleep for probably three hours. Maybe five. Maybe we'll probably do five actually, just to be safe. Alright, four uh, clips of ammo and ten rations of water. That's beautiful. We are going to. Maybe we should drink before we sleep? No, we're just gonna sleep for five hours. We'll probably be fine. Probably be fine. Hopefully, we'll be fine. Brandon was behind everything. Alright, we definitely need to drink now, so let's everybody... Actually, let's see if we really do need to drink right now. Let's check the stamina, and then we'll check the thirst. Alright, everybody's perfect stamina-wise. Thirst, uh... A lot of people need to drink, so yeah, we'll go ahead and give everybody a drink here. If I wanted to really micromanage, I would only give the drinks to people who are okay, but I think we're gonna be fine regardless. Okay, we've got, uh, still a decent amount of time. Let's go east two zones and see what we can find here. We don't want to go too far. I think we're getting pretty close to the uh, checkpoint. Nothing but desert. Nothing but desert. All right. Let's explore to the north. Two zones. Hope for the best. Don't drink before they might pee the bed. Wow. Okay, so uh, hopefully if we go north and then east, that'll work out. Oh, shut up, Grayshock. You're fine. Keo isn't feeding us. Oh, God. There you go, buddy. Take some water. There you go, boy. Who needs water? You? Who needs water right now? I just gave you some water. Hold on a second. Uh, oh, Romero's bad. Oh, okay, yeah, here you go, bud. Yeah, it would really be nice if we could send two scouts in different directions, but... You know, logic, right? That's stupid. Oh, logic is dumb in this game. Oh, man. Come on, buddy. We're gonna be alright. 
So what we're gonna do, I'm gonna check the signal just to be super certain. Pretty sure I already checked it here, but I'm just gonna make sure since it doesn't actually cost any time. Okay, we're gonna go north and then we're gonna go east. We're gonna explore the east zone once. And uh, hope for the best. Okay, Romero needs to explore east one zone. Actually, no, I'm gonna go two. Two zones to the east. Please don't... Okay, thank you. Nothing but desert, nothing but desert. Oh my god, alright. I'm gonna go north one more time. Let's check on our status here. Stamina-wise, everyone's perfect. We'll probably have some thirst problems with this guy. Nil is bad. I'm gonna give you water, and then I'm gonna have you go north. Actually, I don't need to have him go north, because I've already, uh... I've already explored the north because it's nothing but desert. So we're gonna go north once and then we're gonna have him explore the east. Probably. Let's check out our mission status real fast because th I think we're running out of time. 16 hours, yeah, this is uh, dangerous. We're gonna travel north once and then hopefully be able to explore the east relatively well. Let's see if we're actually getting closer here. I hope we are. Really hope we are. Come on, buddy. All right, we're getting closer, man. All right, well, explore two zones to the east, man. See what you can find. Hopefully the freaking base camp, the rendezvous point or something. Nothing but desert. Some kind of shelter. Okay, that's good. Hmm. We don't really need the shelter. Let's go east once. And then we'll check the status of the signal. Should be getting closer when we do that. Let's give, uh, let's check on the thirst again. Hmm. Oh yeah, everybody needs to drink real quick. Okay, let's give water to everybody right now. I think we still have plenty of water right now. Yeah, we have 15 rations, so we're good in that respect. Time is the only critical portion at this point. Yeah, Abraham's dead, unfortunately. Took himself out. Tell you what. Hmm. Well, we know east is safe, so let's go this way. And then let's see if we got closer by doing this. We can't go north here. See if this is closer. Abraham Sudoku, yes he did. Still getting closer. We need to explore to the east, so I wonder if I should take time to rest here. I don't think I can afford it. Yeah, everybody's doing fine anyway. Alright, nil. Explore to the east for me, pal. I need you to go two zones. Can you do that? Can you do it for me, bud? Hopefully. Good, he's back. Nothing but desert. Enemy patrol. Okay, probably gonna have to go east and then north. So let's do that now, and he'll probably need some water after that. Alright. Oh my god. Let's just make sure that Nils does actually need some water before I give it to him here. Yeah, he definitely does. Okay, so here you go, buddy. Here you go, buddy. I'm seriously running low on time. I don't even think I can afford to scout, honestly. So let's check the transceiver real fast. Dehydration hype. God, I wonder what happens when we run out of time, man. That probably is mission over. That would really suck. I only have six hours left. Come on, man. Alright, well... Since I know there's a patrol to the east, I'm gonna go ahead and lead an attack in that direction, and then hopefully that gets us closer to the uh, end goal. So let's send these two out. And call it good. Well, at least now we know the attack was successful. That was pretty obvious. Search these guys up. Sanchez, welcome. Okay, there's some free stuff. I'm like seriously out of time right now. Six hours to the deadline. I think I need to... Uh, let's check the trans or transceiver real fast. Please tell me I'm like one space away. Please? I'm gonna search the north twice. Two zones to the north. Please, please, tell me it's there. Shelter? The camp! 
Nice! Good! Oh, thank god. Okay. Travel north. I think we're gonna get there just in time. Seriously, I think this is like... Literally... Exactly to the deadline. Holy shit. Alright, hold on a second. Let's give water, just because we can. Just to make sure that we can move faster. And then travel north. Please tell me this worked. We made it! We really did it, team. Now chin up, go in there and ask for a beer. You fucking earned it! You're goddamn right! I want to give you something. It's Abraham's dog tag. Know that your identity was lost in that horrific crash, and with no dog tags that could lead to problems with the Constellar Federation, they're not as friendly as they used to be, but... You taught me the meaning of sacrifice. Thanks to you, I am alive. Because of you, Sergeant Abraham's mission has been a success. Accept this and let him live through your deeds. At your command, Abraham. Booyah! Nice! Hell yes! Chapter 5 complete. Don't spend more than 25 hours sleeping. Nice. Don't ever use more than 3 hours to travel between zones. Hell yeah. Reach the camp before the estimated time of a departure. Awesome. Most people had 5 to 7 survive. A very small percentage of people had all 8 survive. Average of 153. How the hell did somebody beat this in 2 hours? What the shit? <laughs> somebody just got really lucky? Alright, most people suicide at Sergeant Abraham. Oh my god. My favorite soldier is Grey Shock. I spent most of my time exploring, which is probably for the best. That's how in the first mission he got Abraham Bird, and yeah! Okay, that makes sense. Wow. Alright, that went well. I'm happy with that. I'm very happy with the results of that mission. That's gonna be it for God's will be watching today, guys. Thank you so much for watching.